What is happening? Welcome to yet another edition of Pitchless Plays D and D. Uh, this is episode nine. We had a very ridiculous episode last time. We'll get to it in a moment. Of course, I am Sor Thunderguard, uh, a uh, a man with a damaged right arm as he searched for Thomas uh, John, a little wizard that cursed him from the clan of Lagany. Uh, below me is Daniel Port playing as. Theo Gratus, a short but speedy and very quick and nimble uh, rogue. Uh, we have Father Manny, played by John Metzelar. He is uh, 65, and uh, we're in his 60s. Cleric talks of the way of ballism and two-thirds of getting all of our revenue of the party. We have our wonderful DM, as always, Michael Levy, uh, who is guiding us on our journey as we play D&D, and, of course, in a very much baseball-themed world. And then we have Austin Bristow, who died last time. That is Glass, the former pirate pirate turned <laughs> way of the light cleric. Well, he is donezo because some cleric decided not to do any <laughs> spells. I'm going to say that's Father Manny. Um, but Austin, you know, I'll give you an opportunity to do something here before we continue and hopefully find someone else that will join us on our quest. Um, obviously, we're all here based on trying to decide between pitcher or dh and what happened last time all right well last time on pitcherless plays D, &D <laughs> as nick says we were on our journey trying to determine who ought to be the next king whether it should be pitcher or dh uh we were in search of the ring of champions which would help us to make this decision so we had been all Defeated in battle uh, in a in this long, arduous cave. We had been defeated by these half-dragon magic users, and uh, but we were not killed. We were all uh, spared our lives, and we were brought before an ancient green dragon uh, who, who introduced him or herself, I don't, didn't catch a uh, gender, as Dayton. Um we were then tasked with slaying a hive of giant killer bees in order to pay our debt of killing basically all of the dragon's followers. And so we we were out along our way and we we're making our way towards Magic City again. And along the way we were attacked by a, uh, a horde of bears, just grizzly bears. Nothing special about them, just just bears. Um, and in the uh, in the heat of battle, glass. My 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 character was felled in battle, and uh, we left off um, after Theo and Father Manny had collected glass's uh, monetary belongings. Sore had collected all of his strange baubles and Father Manny had curled glass into a ball and consecrated his corpse. Well, all right. So, um, so we move on, I guess, past the death of glass and I'll show, of course, there he is dead. Rest <laughs> um, I, I, I woke after because I had been uh, unconscious, I believe. Is that right? Yeah. I think so. I think I was unconscious, and then one of you guys revived me or, or stabilized me. Um, what time is it right now, Mike? Uh, so right now, you guys are traveling most of the day. It's 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 dusk. It's just before sunset. So okay, I I have all of his items. You guys have taken all of his gold and split it between the two of you. Father Manny and, and Theo. It's fine. <laughs> All right. I uh, I guess we're gonna go onward with the cart, right? Are our horses alive? They are. Uh, yes. Char I saved them Charlie the and the newly named Glass are yeah. still yes. alive. One carries <laughs> on Glass's glass legacy. <laughs> <laughs> Completely forgot about that. Um all right, I guess I guess we go onward and and never forget the name Glass through our horse. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I guess we just continue on. Because at this point, you guys had taken a long rest. You had gone off to the side to recoup and all that kind of stuff. So. Correct. 
Did we put Glass's body on the cart and then unload it? <laughs> yes, we, we did. Yeah. We did. Yeah. <laughs> you, 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 yeah, never mind. you pulled me off to the side, and then you just kind of set me on the ground and curled me into a ball. That's apparently what they do in ballism is just curl curl the, the, uh, the corpse into a ball and then just leave them for the crows. Yeah, it's better this way. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That's Some crazy religion. I don't know. <laughs> the way of Lord the, Double It's Day, the no circle question. of life. <laughs> I get it. All right. Okay. Let, let, let's let's go here down the road. Uh, so if you guys are picking up after you take a long rest, it is now obviously not sunset, but sunrise. Right. Oh and we did we investigate the bears yet? Uh. Yes. Yes, you did go through and search the bears. If I remember right, Sora had found like a few silver. Yes. Uh, I think it was a few gold, but yeah. Oh yeah, and I didn't share it with you guys. You, he did not know. Fine. <laughs> We're even now. <laughs> Get you some apples, don't worry. Get you some apples. We are so not. Okay. <laughs> so wait, who's uh, who's I guess driving this thing. I guess I am. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Thor, uh, Sora is just laying down, one arm, one leg out, and one off, like that. Mm. So I don't know how well we're gonna do when we get started here. Roll a seven on my animal handling. It's a good start. Uh, give me survival as well. Yep. Roll it now. Oh, a 22. Oh, not 20 on my survival. Natural 20 on the survival. That helps. Hey, all right. Okay. Um, <laughs> so as you're going along, it's it's tough to get those horses to move. I mean, they were both down, almost dying. Um, not too happy about the fact that you brought them into a den of bears. Uh, so... It, it takes a while, but they start going. Um, you do get them on, back on the road. Uh, they seem to be a, a little happier walking on the road again. Uh, and uh, you, you make it along your way. You uh, you seem to know where you're going pretty well. Very well, actually. You are very, very sure that you're going the right way. Um, I, I Sora puts out his head a lot to like look around to see if there's any, like, I don't know. I'm looking out for the postman. Okay, give me a perception check. Sure. Let's uh, let's get some get some good old rolls in, huh? I'm really I'm really worried about this postman. You know. So, so worried. Sora's <laughs> looking around. He's still mourning the poor. loss of glass. Not quite sure. Am I? What's going on? <laughs> I'm just I'm or very not. He might not I'm very be disappointed young. in glass. And I, I mean I, I'm obviously mourning it, but I've seen a lot of warriors in my day succumb. And you know, it, it's it's unfortunate. It's just it's really just unfortunate. Either you know, way, you know, he's, so his he's, mind is distracted and he is not being as vigilant as he thought. He's just making the same broken as glass joke in his head. <laughs> over and over and over again. So, as you guys travel along for a few hours, uh, on the road, on the side of the road, you do see a sign. And okay. uh, the sign does look like it has an engraving on it. But there is also what appears to be a message in blood. Okay. Is there anything at the base of this sign? Not even an ace. No. What does the message say? Okay. <laughs> so the sign itself says um, uh, that it, it says you are entering the domain of Devil City. Oh. Um, which basically means you just crossing over to territory you you were no longer in the land controlled by national city but that controlled by devil city and in the red uh in the red blood is crossed out devil city 
and basically uh, it's uh, it's crossed out and edited as the Renegades. The okay. Renegades. Yes. Hmm. Okay. Can I sniff the blood? Sure. Sniff the blood. I want to do a survival check to try and figure out what kind. Like, uh, if well, if you want to find out what kind it is, that would be a nature check. Yeah. Sixteen. Um. So based on your, I don't know, experience with dead things. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I do have a lot of that. <laughs> I do. The blood so seems the of time. some sort of animal. Okay. You can't, you're not quite sure what it is. It it doesn't seem like it is humanoid. It doesn't seem very mystical. Just your general animal. Is there anything on the back of the sign? Uh, uh, the back of the sign, there is nothing. No. Lots of Can we see Devil City from where we are? No. So, uh, which direction is it pointing? Uh, it's not pointing anywhere. It's as like so. Like think of when you're on like the highway and you enter a new state. It says oh. entering, like that. Is it? Um, is it like? If I were to take this post out of the ground, is it in the shape of a warhammer? No. So oh. it's actually so the sign itself is about uh, four feet wide. Okay. Uh, two feet tall, and it's on two posts. Can I do a perception check to see if anyone's watching us look at the sign? Sure. Because sure. I'm like, yo, this is this is totally a trap, guys. I'll give him a hand when he's given that he says that. I'm gonna give him a hand with it, so give you advantage. Okay. Fantastic. Um, it does. It don't sense anyone watching you. Okay. Uh, it does seem like that the road itself is not being traveled which is kind of odd because it is the main road interesting interesting okay okay um well all right looks like we're in devil city but some animal is taking over okay don't be afraid wow. i have a new spell in my holster what is it, what is healing it? word you can do it what <laughs> yes that's right it took some convincing, but I'm finally ready to play ball, if you catch my drift. <laughs> Lots of negotiation. The ball is in your court. Yes. I'm ready to help out as needed. To pick up the slack from that that ra that layabout glass. <laughs> I think you finally understand the circle of life. <laughs> I do, I do. I know it well. <laughs> so let's venture forth. Let's not be afraid. Onward. What awaits. So are we going to Magic City? No, oh, Magic City. We're going, to Magic City. we're going to go to Devil City. There's and, no fork. So if you look at your map, uh, when you pull it can up, I look at my map. It's it's in your handouts, so you have. Okay, it. okay, okay. Oh, you... oh, I see. So Devil City goes to the left. Magic City goes north. Yeah, that's yes. what I was, I was So sure you're what. not quite at the fork yet because the border is before that, but uh, with your perception roll, you can see that there is a fork up ahead. And from uh, your map that you have, you know that if you go to the left, you could head to Devil City. If you continue straight, that's the road to Magic City. Now, I have always understood that uh, the Devil City is very insignificant relative to the other cities around it. Does not it, it doesn't have much revenue. They don't they don't spend much. I'll say no more. I'm not interested. I've always heard though that they rumor that they uh you know creatively use what they have to, to still hold their own, right? Well, yes, there's blood on this. They didn't even get ink. They wrote blood. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so do we have a reason to go to Devil City or a need to or you know, we want to just keep pushing on. I don't know. It smells like a trap. I mean, it smells like a trap. <laughs> if there's oh. no money, I'm not interested. So I say we bypass it. Magic City. 
Okay. Magic City it is. Magic, Magic City, City it is. Sorry, Bristow. <laughs> <laughs> Snells Like a Trap was the best pun you've done. Like, full, full stop in all my oh, no. sessions. I mean, but... I, I was just saying is if you, if you were in Devil City, I'm really sorry. Oh, yeah, his character's now no longer joining. Exactly. That's so. I'll, I'll join you guys in session ten. Uh, deuces. See you guys <laughs> get out of here. So you guys continue forward towards uh, Magic City. Um, so whoever's driving, uh, as you look ahead, there appears to be a tree down in the middle of the road. Uh, I guess stop the car. Um point out the tree does it look like is it like large enough that like the three of us combined couldn't move it i shall show you ah all right let's uh can we just go around on the left uh so that is very um thick uh brush so it will take some you know very good maneuvering by your driver to get through. Can um can do a perception check and I shout out to everyone said I I wonder if there's someone put this down to ambush us. Speaking of smells like a trap, right? Smells like a trap. <laughs> uh right. yeah. I'm going perception check. Yep. To see. That's an eleven. An eleven? Okay. Terrible. Intently looking. <laughs> and he always... Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. So you look around. It, it doesn't appear that anyone is watching you. Okay. It, from what you see, it just looks like there's a tree in the road. Does the base of the tree look like... Does it, like, say still have all of its roots and stuff, so it looks like it just got, like, uprooted, or does it look cut down? Why don't you roll me a nature check? Sweet. Good question. Um, it's a four. No rule. Ooh, nothing good. The the tree appears to have fallen in the middle of the road. You do not know why. You do not know how. It is a tree fall in the middle of the road. Guys, uh, right. Right. guys there you go. Falls in the middle what do you, what of the do you road. see about this tree? If tree well, nothing away, really. It's in the way. That's all I can really tell about it. Uh, we need to get it out of the way. And listen, doing things fast is what Theo does well. Moving big things, not so much. All right. So Sor comes out and he tries to lift the tree to make it so to push Sor. it to the side. So there's more room for Charlie and Glass. And so are, as you get out of the cart. Trap. <laughs> Swing! Um, there's an arrow. Are, that comes what's through. your AC? Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I should have said I was going to do it like with a dodge ready. No, no, no. I'm moving out over here. Okay. Wherever you move out, good. Uh, what's your AC? Uh, 16. Uh, you are going to get hit. Oh, my God. <laughs> for eight piercing damage. As nope, a bolt. five, baby, 26. You Sorry, are correct. Mm. Uh, for five piercing damage, uh, you are going to get hit um, with a bolt from a crossbow, and I need everyone to... Can I sense what direction that came from? Yeah, I was about to ask the same question. I need everyone to roll initiative. Uh, it direction? came from. I'm going to say it's down here. Where? Oh, wait. I'm on the wrong layer. Hold on. This direction. Yeah. Okay. I got it. Yeah. You know. Do I have anything that catches things on fire? <laughs> That's just what you're really going to catch things on fire. I would love if I could find a Warhammer that adds fire damage because it's a heater. Oh, oh, there you go. Nice. That would be that would be kind of amazing. You know who's really good at catching things on fire? Wait, I'm sorry. What just happened? Um, oh, glass. Um, I see that Austin. Uh, yeah, don't don't roll the initiative. Don't do anything. Just, just, just ignore good. that. 
<laughs> Ooh, what? I oh, rolled no. really well too. Actually rolled perfectly. Oh, I love it so much, Austin. You don't know. I love it. You don't know. I love it. You know who was really good at setting things on fire, though? Glass. Glass. Glass really liked to set things on fire. Yes, he did. So are you were up first. Um. So, all right. So a new perception check. So, okay, so I felt yep. it come from the south, right? Yep. Yep. You can make a perception check to look. <laughs> nice. 20. Ooh. 30, 20. Okay. Uh, so as you look. can see him uh are you looking all around or just in the direction it came from uh i'm looking everything essentially south of, uh, like um south of this map you know not towards the north of the road <clears throat> is that it oh man okay not like a mess. <clears throat> um, is this a uh, double, like difficult terrain? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The the brush, yeah. Okay. So I have thirty movement. Lord. <laughs> Five. Ten. 25. Can I go here? Yeah. Sweet. I'm going to give him a fastball. Okay. With, a, with Darthen. That's a 23 uh, for 14 damage. That is certainly going to hit. And he is certainly dead. Okay. I'm Ooh. going to do action surge. Okay. To go down to here. Okay. And swing does the. Does uh, give you another movement? It does not. What? I action surge? I don't think it gives you movement. Oh, I figured it was just another. Oh. Not another turn. It's just you get another it's action. It's just an action and bonus action. Oh, no. I didn't even think about that. Oh, that sucks. All right. I'm also ready to be like a one man wrecking crew. <laughs> <laughs> um, then I. Uh, can I take a bonus action to like duck? In the like, well, okay, how high is the brush? Um, it's it's like uh, it's probably about like a uh, uh, three foot tall grass. Okay, so I'm not going to make myself prone, but I am going to duck and be ready to like come up and swing if he needs to be. You know what I mean? I, I okay. like to take more of the half, like some cover on it, but not all the way. Okay, that's all. Um, I'm going to say, cowards, come fight. <laughs> Yeah, that's how cool I am. I like it. What up, Nature Detroit? Good to see you. All right. Now he's gonna come up. He's gonna try and swat at me, huh? Yep. He's not. He's no yeah, coward. I figure out what else I want to do. Hold on. Well, he's gonna die. He's gonna miss, and then he's gonna riposte. Okay, I didn't even roll anything yet. Riposte. <laughs> Okay, I'll start with him. He will try to attack you with his scimitar. He's going to crit. No, he's not. Yes, he is. Oh. <laughs> it's like the opposite of what I said. And you are going to take 7 minus 3, so 4 slashing. Okay, so it's not like... So if it's crit, though, it's like double, right? Yes. But is it double, like... So if you were to deal four twice or something, is it like one twice then? No, no, because okay. you just take um, from the... So it still counts as just one attack. So you take minus yeah, two okay, from the total okay. attack. That makes sense. If he had multi-attack and he attacked twice, then yeah. I am. All right. Uh, this next guy is going to shoot at Theo because he is in the front. <laughs> Okay. That. What is your AC? <laughs> 16. Okay, he's going to miss. Mm. Ah, too far. Mm. Yeah, he is. 
Do a little dance at him. You had 16 AC? Yeah. Wow. High, high dexterity, man. The nice thing about having a 19 dex, yeah. <laughs> wow. What? Wow. Wow. Excuse me. Whoa, that's a lot. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> well, all right what then. I am in some trouble. I'm coming. Well, you're fine. You're doing your thing. Maybe I shouldn't have added healing word. No, <laughs> no healing word is a bonus spell you can make. You're going to need more attacks. No. More power. You only need one. <laughs> <laughs> like you do scorching ray that hits multiple people. He doesn't have oh, scorching what? ray, but glass what's happening. Glass has. Oh, glass did. Oh, oh. who's hey, glass? Jesus. Oh, right, 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 right. The uh, yeah. <laughs> the horse. The horse. Yeah, yeah, the, horse. <laughs> the horse can use scorching ray. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so these first three guys are at the bottom. Uh, <laughs> the first two are going to attack Father Manny. Hang in there, Father. Uh, you're going to get two slashing damage from the first one. What's your AC? 16. Okay, you're going to get another two slashing damage from the second one. Uh, the next... Don't hurt, Manny, I know. The next guy is going to attack Theo. And you're going to get three slashing damage. Okay. Uh, then the next... Then there's going to be the back two the guys in the top left are going to shoot at Father Manny. Uh, that's a nat one. That's going to miss. <laughs> Repost A. next... Two are, <laughs> the next two are going to shoot at Theo. Uh, that's going to hit for eight piercing. Oof. And what's your AC? 18, 16? 16. 16? It's going to hit yeah. for five piercing. Oof. All right. Looks like we already know where your first healing was going to go. <laughs> They're Theo, circling you are us. Up. I feel so confused. Uh, I guess I'm going to stab one of them. Uh, the, I guess, yeah. Uh, probably the one who I don't I guess I don't get any advantages against either one of them particularly, but I will try and free Father Manny here a little bit. Um, so I'll attack the one that's in front of him first. Okay. All right. Rapier your time. Uh, 18 mm, yep. for a total of 9 damage. Yes. And let's see here. What happened to the cart? Had to move it. Good. Calm like yourself. That, like that cart. He's still <laughs> like, I'm done. I'm out of here. You guys are mad. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I guess that's my turn. Um, I can't stealth in there, and I can't. <laughs> uh, there's no sense to disengaging, I guess, so. I'm going to stand my ground. Down the eight hit points already. <laughs> Father Manny. Okay. Um, I'm going to move. Well, remember, the... attack of opportunity. Oh, right. <laughs> Oh, man. All right. Let's try to finish off this guy with... Kill me. I will. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do a Guiding Bolt right in his face. Yeah, I get him. Just a heads up. If you use a Guiding Bolt, you can't heal him. Yeah. I thought it was... Uh... No, but oh, that's right. Spell, you can only use one spell. spell. So you could do a cantrip and and healing word, or you could smack him with your gavel and healing. Word. I get a feeling that these guys don't have a lot of health. No, they don't. So you don't need to like overkill with a guiding bolt. All right. So I I rescind my guiding bolt. That's fine. And I cast the cantrip told the dead. Yes. Um, they have to be. They have to be hurt. Or maybe not. Oh no 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 yeah one well, day. It's yeah. a D12 if they're hurt. It's a D8 if they are not. Yeah. He has been hurt, so he makes the wisdom save. Mm -hmm. It's probably going to fail. 
He is not going to fail. Wow. <laughs> All right. Uh, and then now I will use my first healing word. Hope you guys are proud of me. On Theo. Oh, I'll roll a 1d4. Okay. So proud. <laughs> you have, what, four hit points? Yeah. Hold on. What's his spellcasting modifier? It's probably three. Yeah, it's only three. Yeah, yeah it's like it. I love it. Thank you, Father Manny. You're welcome. Wonder how that feels. Okay. Uh, Austin, can you roll a perception check for me before you go? Absolutely. I'll go ahead and do that real quick. 19. Okay. Oh my god, that name. <laughs> you don't you don't know anything. I know, I know, I know. I'm not I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just anything. So you see that guy hiding in the cool. bush as well. Cool, cool, no doubt, no doubt. All right. So I assume I'm like on horseback. Uh no, you're not. You okay. you have just been walking. That's fine. I like walking in chain mail, but sure. Um, <laughs> so I will stride forward and get up to about there, I think. One, Ooh. Two, three, four, five, six. Yep. And I will call out to everyone. Uh, <clears throat> And I will say, gentlemen, gentlemen, please, a moment <laughs> of your time. Lay down your arms and please just give me one moment. What? <laughs> <laughs> sure. But they attacked I, me. Mike, where do you, you want to go? You want, you want me to keep talking or? Um... Let's Help see us. how Sor reacts. Sor is going to swing with a fastball at this one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> and Sor is going to miss. I... I'll do a precision attack. Okay. 15. Wow. Sora's going to hit for seven bludgeoning. How's it look? Uh, he's looking bad, but still alive. Aww. Man. Um, By the way, what you guys... I, I'm not sure how big this tree is, but on the other side of the tree, the, uh, the voice that called out to you, you would see a, uh, a large figure in heavy chain mail, with a big tower shield that has uh, stripes going down. Uh, <laughs> he has a, uh, a morning star on his belt. Mm. Uh, like I said, very, very tall guy, big guy. And what's interesting is, I don't know how many of you guys have experience with this. What's interesting is instead of like skin on his face, he has white scales. He, is a, he is a dragonborn. Ah, lovely. Uh, well, Sora is going to take an action surge and do this and again. Miss. He's going to miss. A superiority die. Let's go. Vision attack. For 10. Going to miss. Well, very disappointed. I. Uh, Someone else is disappointed that you are still attacking. So, I'm going to then move over here. Okay, he's going to get attack for opportunity. Yes, he is. Uh, he's going to hit for four slashing. Oh, my lord. One. For one, then. <laughs> one slashing, you are correct. It That's is why slash. I was okay with it. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm upset that I didn't kill that guy, though. Um, and, that, and I'm going to shout to the, that man, like, why stop? I'm fighting, and they deserve it. Don't know you. Come help. Um, Bring out <laughs> Austin, because I'm not going to reveal your name yet. Uh, can you roll a persuasion check for me? 
Yes, I can. Ah, yes, for everyone else. 13. Not great. Okay. So these guys are going to go. Let's see how many stopped. What are we fighting? Who like just bandits? They are people. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, just some dudes. So two of them are gonna stop and look at the dragonborn who has just entered the battlefield. The rest will continue. <laughs> Wait, we didn't get a chance to surrender. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Okay. Uh, so, this first one, I'm going to start here, is going to attack Soar. Going to try. With, with advantage. Yep. And still miss. And repost day. I mean, waste three superiority die. Atta boy. To kill one. Uh, come on. Yeah. Get uh, done. And overkills on that one. Wait, 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 wait. Well done. Okay. It doesn't even matter. <laughs> overkills on that one. Uh, this next one here is actually going to turn around and as he feels this big guy of Sora coming up to him, and he's going to attack Sora. Yep. He's going to miss. Yeah, he is. Uh, as as Sora cackles. <laughs> this guy is also going to attack Sora. Yeah, he is. He's going to hit for what would be three slashing, two so nothing. zero slashing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, this guy here is going to attack Father Manny. Face me, you coward! Uh, and you're gonna take, and he's gonna take seven slashing. Oh no! Use it on yourself, Father Manny. I'm fine. <laughs> this guy here is going to attack Theo, and he's gonna hit for five slashing. This guy here is also going to attack Theo, I, and oh, hit for three slashing. Oh my gosh! Okay. So many. Uh, this I guy is going to attack Father Manny. With his crossbow, he's going to miss. And this guy is going to attack Theo with his crossbow and miss. Theo, you are up. Take a okay. potion. Well, um, I guess I'm just going to attack the guy right in front of me, I guess. Um... So it seems like they have about 10 hit points. Might as well just try and take one down. Okay, I rolled a... A nine will not hit. Doesn't matter if I'm conscious at this rate in a minute. Anyways. <laughs> I don't get advantage at all for being having them adjacent to any of these. Any of our oh, guys? Yeah, attack. He would get he would get sneak attack on the damage, but he doesn't get. Oh yeah, attack. right. I'm yeah, I'm being stupid. Yeah. Wait, but don't I? I guess okay. See because I thought I could draw a straight line to soar through him, but I see what you're saying. Uh oh no no so because they're medium sized, the only way is to be like directly opposite. Okay. Or like he, yeah. if there was a guy here. Or if you he were here and there. Sorry, I positioned it with Father Manny and not you. And so I basically, you just Manny. have to be mad. Uh, anything else? No, I guess I'm good. Yeah, okay. I'm good. Father Manny. All right. Can I use Healing Word on myself? Yes. All right, cool. Uh, and if I attack this guy, would it be at advantage since Sword's yes. on? Yes. Okay. 
So I'll attack that guy with another Toll the Dead. Uh, don't... What? Well, no, it needs to be like a weapon. Toll the for... Dead would not give you advantage because that's a saving throw. It has to be something. Uh, okay. But it's okay. You should use the weapon that you have or something at advantage. That might work. Yeah, in that case, I'm going to swing the Commissioner's Gavel. <laughs> and... Oh, my Lord. <laughs> uh, five does three. not hit. I'd like Four. to think that you guys aren't performing as well because in the back of your minds... The words of that dragonborn are just like, maybe I should. Sora is crushing them. <laughs> maybe we should stop fighting. Sora is destroying. Uh, Father Manny, you can go ahead and roll your um, healing word for okay. yourself. And one d four. Uh, roll a d four. You get five yeah. hit points. Sweet. Nice. Oh, I like this healing word. It's quite nice, actually. Very helpful. <laughs> And that will be my turn. Very fitting that the first heal. Oh, I guess it's the second one. He had to be in it himself. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dragonborn, you are up. Fantastic. And I just keep confidently striding forward. I'm going to go around the tree here. So that can be. There's ten. I can. I can go through here without any issue, right? Yes. Cool. So there's fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Gets me about there. And I'll just again, I with the we my weapon still on my belt, and like I've got my shield on, but otherwise hands are up and everything. Gentlemen, as I understand, if my observations are correct, there are two parties at hand here, and it seems that one of you would like something from the other. Now, could each party tell me which of you is in charge and who would like to speak on behalf of your group? Um, so I it's going to be Thor's turn next, right? So I assume yes. that's your turn, uh, Bristo. That is my turn. Uh, Thor is going to answer with a, a battle cry of a yell. Be like, ah! Uh, that's literally his response. Um, and I do have a question, Mike. A sweeping attack. I know it's, I think it says like five feet within. But Let me double that, check. I know what you're asking. Let me check. Yeah. Can I get all three? So I'll be, that's exactly how that should work. I think that's how that works. I believe it is, but I'm just going to double check. Well, I got to hit once, but I'll do the one at advantage. So I should. Mike, did you want another persuasion check? Uh, yeah, actually, that'd be good. Let me go ahead and do that. So I'm all about listening. Moment. Not, oh, not, not one. <laughs> not one. one. Okay. <laughs> I'm doing real well. Are you offering us you arbitration? You broke in draconic instead of common. Sweeping Whoops. attack. When you hit a creature. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, Father Manny, I am absolutely 100% offering you arbitration. That is exactly. It is just one other target. Ah. Oh. Sorry. It's okay. Well, I, at the very least, I am going to do that. Oh, this guy. I mean, I'm going to just at least just basic attack at least. Okay. Uh, is that hit? Uh, you thank God you have advantage. Yeah. Um, I, I am going to sweeping attack. I uh, and do the one under here. Uh, um. Okay. So I need to. Let's see. Okay, so yeah, I just I just roll a superiority die and it takes that. Hold on. No, never mind. I don't want to do that. I don't want. Um, actually, I'll do it for. Okay, can I look to see if any of these are damaged? Yeah, hold on. I, think, I don't think. Hit. I don't think I, you've hit any of them, right? I don't think so either. Yeah. I am not sure which roll to use. Me neither. Wait, but I'm just asking which ones are which ones damaged. Neither of them are hit. Oh, okay, then I'm not doing I'm not doing anything. Okay. I'm just taking that one down and cackling some more. Uh, <laughs> my initial gut reaction is that it would use the eight, not the fifteen. Yeah. Um for what? For the attack roll. No, well it says if the attack roll would hit, then if the original it... attack roll would hit. Yeah, well, this is 15 because I took that one because I was at an advantage. Like, you, if I, if we're playing in person, I would just roll two die. We wouldn't know which one was the which, right? 
That's correct. That's true. Or are, are you saying for the sweeping attack, which Nick is now saying he's not doing? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah I would. I would so it's a non-issue. But but like yeah, yeah, yeah it's like a non-issue it, now. But I was just yeah, yeah, but that's just something to know. That's an interesting. I think you're right. I, I would use the fifteenth. That's yeah. right. That's okay, but anyway, not using it, and I okay. tackle, and that's my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So with your net one, you net are one. not going to gain any more people. Absolutely not. Because he spoke in draconic. Whoops. Well, I, you guys didn't respond when I spoke in common, so Very I just cool, thought. Man. I just thought, well, you know, Draconic I might, trying might to get the point across. Going. Very <laughs> foolish. I thought Draconic might get the point across a little better. I don't know. Okay. Just, Let's... Tr- gotta, gotta try something. Move you here. Know, how close? Um, we'll move you here. Love it so much, Austin. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We will start with this guy here. He is going to attack Soar. He's going to try. He's going to roll a nat one. All right. Is that your last one already? Yeah, but this is why I saved it, because I wanted to. Uh, A 10 does not hit. (laughs) No, I would have killed him, too. You would have killed him. It's difficult. Um, This guy is going to attack Father Manny. He's going to miss. This guy is also going to attack Father May. Uh, No, he is going to turn around and attack Soar. Yeah, he is. He's going to miss. Yeah. um, Soar's going to shout repost day and do nothing. (laughs) Oh. (laughs) (laughs) This guy is going to attack Theo. And uh, Theo, you are down because he critted. Oh, no. Okay. Well, Father Mandy, you can use your healing word on him. Uh, this guy is going to shoot Father Manny, or shoot at Father Manny, and he's going to miss. Uh, this guy is also going to shoot at Father Manny and roll a nat one and miss. Yes. This guy is going to attack this guy who originally had his attention and now pissed him off by speaking draconic whoops <laughs> uh, what's your ac higher than whatever he rolled nope, yeah he rolled there you a go 19 he rolled a 19 okay that does hit for four slashing all right and this last guy's gonna shoot a crossbow at you i will give you half cover and he's still gonna hit with half cover wow wow uh, what do you roll piercing what did he roll? 22. Damn. For three piercing? Okay. Cool. Uh, cool, the, cool. No doubt. No doubt. Uh, That's a saving throw. Yep. Not for one. <laughs> uh, you're going to have like seven death saves pop up. I'm just trying to find it. It's, it's on four the, stats uh, at the bottom right corner. Yeah, there we go. That oh. just shows he has never had to do this before. <laughs> <laughs> so that is uh, one fail. Father <laughs> Manny, you were up. All right. Um, Feeling word on Theo. Yeah, time to bring the gavel down on this guy. Get him. Get him. Yeah. yeah. 16 will hit for five bludgeoning. Nice. All right. Now I'm going to cast another healing word on my friend Theo over here. Okay. Converting to ballism more and more every day. Uh, so that's six HP. Sweet. I'm back. <laughs> that's a lot better than none. Uh, that is it. Yeah. Dragonborn, all. you were up. You have been attacked. No one seems to be listening to you. And so I'll just go, well, fine. If no one wants to listen, and I will turn to the (laughs) guy who's right next to me with a deftness that would surprise most, I will draw my Morningstar and just 
bash the ever loving heck out of him. What's the exit velocity of his head? Uh, <laughs> high. Launch angle? Uh, it's actually I'm gonna kind of spiked into the ground. Honestly. Yeah, he probably does a little bit. Except I missed. And he's gonna miss. It's a big healthy back though. I love yeah. describing an attack and then rolling to see what happens. <laughs> silvered. Morning. Careful, don't pull an oblique. Oh man. Okay, Why so I did this... silvered. Yeah. Don't, this... don't 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 hurt your rib. Oh you know? yeah. Um. And he'll, I'll also just just uh, shout uh, as I as I cast sanctuary upon myself. I will shout. I wanted to do this the easy way. Now I'm going to have to do this the difficult way. <laughs> And that is my turn. Okay. Soar, you are up. Whoa, what is this? What is, is this? You ward a creature within range. Okay. Yeah, but I use it on myself. Okay. Soar is going to say, the difficult way is the fun way. <laughs> I don't like you. You should. I'm, I'm carrying this entire battle. No, no, you're not. <laughs> Double, Double now. <laughs> Amazing. Oh my See? god. See? <laughs> ones. Oh wow. Uh, I miss intentionally as I shout to the uh, the unknown warrior, saying, "See how easy it is for you to deal with this." And he's like, Whoop. And I'm, I tried to do that, and. Uh, and that's my lovely, uh, lovely turn. Okay. That's amazing. <laughs> uh, we'll start Hold with up. this guy who will try to attack Soar. He will try. What's your AC? 16. He's going to hit for, I guess, zero. negative one, which is zero. So I gain a life? No. <laughs> <laughs> he hits you and you just feel yourself be boosted up. Like, like, that, that felt good. Uh, the <laughs> next guy here yeah, is like, also going to try to attack you. You like he got my armor back in place. For uh, <laughs> now, one he's gonna miss. Cool, amazing. Cool, cool. Where were these rolls a minute ago? <laughs> <laughs> this guy is going to attack Father Manny, uh, and he's gonna miss. Nice. Uh, this guy here is oops is gonna shoot at Father Manny, and he's gonna miss. Yes. This guy is also going to shoot at Father Manny. Ooh, that was going to hit for seven piercing. Ooh. How you doing? I've got three HP. Yes! <laughs> this guy is going to roll a wisdom save. DC and attack no one. This guy is going to run up here and roll a wisdom save. And attack no one. This guy is going to run up here and roll a wisdom save. Uh, attack of opportunity for a... Uh... No, because he, I was, uh, he's laying down inside the cart. Okay. And he's going to attack no one as well. Wow. Wait, I there, thought that man. cart... How did that cart get there? I thought that cart was just a phantom cart. Father Manny, you magically lose 10 HP. <laughs> <laughs> Theo, you are up. You are prone lying down in the cart. I will... Does being lying down on the cart make it harder for them to hit me? Uh, they can't hit you right now unless they climb into the cart. Can I hit them? Uh, not unless you sit Dang up. <laughs> Alright, then I will stand back up. Okay. And I will try once again try to stab the guy in front of me. Okay. <laughs> For the third 300th time. One. Natural one. It's probably gonna happen. I just... I, it's entertaining at this point. You just want chaos. I like oh, it. absolutely. Like... Nice! Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, done, though. That will definitely kill him. Ha -ha! Don't call it a comeback. I've been here for years. 
As, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. As the dragonborn is surrounded by just three men that all just kind of look dazed and instead of instead of attacking him, they uh, wanted they, they, they all went <laughs> to attack. They're just like, nah. This this guy just stabs. That's the dude. All this bloodshed is completely unnecessary, gentlemen. If you would just listen to me. Uh, Theo, you doing anything else? Um. Yeah, no, I think I'm okay. You could lay back down. <laughs> <laughs> and just be like, I'm tired. <laughs> I used to get hit this much. <laughs> Father Manny, you're up. All right. I'm going to make another swing of the old gavel. Okay. Nice. Yeah, we'll nice hit. Done. And with my bonus action, I will use another healing word. Got to say, really feeling this spell right now. <laughs> it's your last uh, one, right? On myself, yeah. Nice. I'm telling you, that's five hit points. You need five this. HP. Back up to eight. Yeah. I think you understand maybe. now a little bit about why we uh, we, we talked about it a bit. You have second level spells. Yeah. Like, you could use the cast healing word. Yeah, do I get any benefit from that? Or it's oh, yeah, you get no, it's, it's another D4. D4. Oh, like wow, okay. 2D4. Oh, that's dope. Good point, Austin. Uh, Dragonborn. No, no, yeah, wait, roll another D4, because you've essentially exhausted that, right? No, that was his uh, fourth. Yeah, that, that was, was my last. Level one. His fourth. Oh, level one. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah okay. He just has... Still has, what, two level two? I think. Yeah. Yeah, two level two. Okay. So next time. All right, so I am... Surrounded by three men who are all just kind of dazed, thinking they were going to attack me and then decided not to. Mm -hmm. And uh, no one's listening to me at this point, right? Is that, is that is that where we're at? No one is listening to me. Not the not these three in the carts. Not who are you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> with your nat, with your nat one, you lost everyone. Okay, great, fantastic. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, well, then I'm just gonna. Again, try to s smash a guy, and I'm gonna attack this dude here. So let's do that. Because now I'm a little frustrated that no one's listening. Oh yeah, uh, that will definitely hit. Yeah, we'll go ahead and I'll pump some smite into that as well. There you go. So uh, we'll go ahead, and so that's gonna be an extra. Ah yes. It's a D8, that's I believe. Two. Two D8. Smite, yes. Extra, extra two D eight. Like it. Uh, yes, a paladin. <laughs> uh, yeah, he is definitely dead. What is that? What is what is smite? Um, basically, so, I get whenever I decide that someone is not cooperating, sure. I'm just going to take my morning star, make it really shiny, and it hurts a lot more. Oh, I like that. So it's that fun. extra 10 is radiant damage that he's Correct. doing. Correct. So that's a bonus action? It's not no. anything. It doesn't cost any action. He could spell? just, it costs him a, it costs me a, a spell, spell slot. slot. Yeah. Okay. So Slide. he just goes, I just want to smite and done. Yeah, I just decide to smite and then I smite. So yeah, that guy just got smited. Um, and I will just say to his compatriots, will you listen to me now or do you wish to end up like your friend? What was his name? What was his name? Roll an intimidation check. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. His name was Robert Paulson. <laughs> Six. Oops. <laughs> Oh my lord. It's weird. It's, I it's, it's such almost a high like, charisma. It's, yeah, it's almost like paladins are supposed to be charismatic. I have such a high Oh wow, charisma. you have a plus four. Oh, that's your oh 18 is charisma, my God. lord. Oh, so are you. So we're just going to shout like, surely you weren't talking about me. I don't know his name. His name is... Uh... 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 Chipper. Larry. He's gonna swing. Once again. <laughs> He's gonna swing. <laughs> huh? Thirteen. That's gonna hit. Yeah. Yes. And he's dead. And then I'm going to run up to here. Okay. And shout in this man's ear. <laughs> <laughs> ah! 
Hello, friend. <laughs> and that's it. Okay. Uh, well, this guy, as you shout in his ear, is going to turn and try to attack you. Yes. I got your father, Manny. <laughs> Thank uh, you. He's going to miss. Already uh, post day. He shouts back. Yeah, nothing for, happens. for, for <laughs> no action whatsoever. That's uh, it. This guy is going to try to shoot Father Manny. He's going to miss. Yes. This yes. guy is going to try to shoot Theo. Ooh. He's going to miss. <laughs> this guy is going to attack. He's going to make a wisdom save. No, the spell ended. No, it did not. Yeah, it says if the warded creature makes an attack, casts a spell that affects an enemy, or deals damage to another creature, the spell ends. Well, I don't like that. I didn't read <laughs> that part of the spell, and I wish you hadn't either. <laughs> uh, he's going to attack with, with advantage. advantage. He's going to hit for three slashing. Okay. And the next one is going to crit. Good. Good. Uh, for seven slashing. Awesome. Okay. Theo. All right. It's time to get these. Uh, let's see. I will turn and with my um, with my bow, I'm going to try and get this guy that's caught between uh, Father Manny and uh, – because has he been hurt at all? He has been hurt, yes. Mm. I have one to free up sore. I, I, rampaging I the ones in the trees. That's all I was gonna think about. Okay, I'm gonna shoot at the guy uh, who shot at me. Okay. Uh, fifteen does hit. Okay. For nice. ten piercing. Mm-hmm. He's still up. No. <laughs> Were you hidden? No, no, I'm just in the middle of a cart, unfortunately. <laughs> Where to hide? Like, lay down and, like, right over the edge of the, the cart. <laughs> uh, well, good job. Anything else? Um, no, I'm okay for now. I would like to drop prone. <laughs> Father Manny. <laughs> All right. Uh, I feel as if we have a judge in our midst. But regardless, I shall be the jury and executioner and swing my <laughs> gavel once more at this Cretan. Advantage. Yeah, yes. advantage. Oh, no. 12 is enough to hit for five yes! damage. Yeah, yeah. Just enough and he is dead. Yes. yes. <laughs> Love it. Good job. And... So much unnecessary bloodshed. You're telling me. How are you guys looking? Are you uh, are you feeling healthy and, and chipper? Uh, I only have what six hit points. I think. Let, 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 you should heal. But, you. Chipper oh, has a hole in his head next to next to uh, the dragonborn here. Who did that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll cast a healing word on Theo. Never love balls and... more in my whole life. So two d four. Yeah. Do another D4 there. There you go. Six so plus four, nine. Nine HP. Yes. Sweet. Feel the healing no. power of ballism. Oh, I'm a Don't you worry. I am a believer now. <laughs> okay. How do I want to do this? Let's go ahead. Hmm couple of fun options, but we're just going to go ahead and uh, try to smush this guy here. Okay. Seems like the best way to go at this point. Uh, that will definitely hit him. All right. And I am not going to smite. Instead, I'm with my bonus action. I'm going to cast Sanctuary on myself. Okay. And that will be my turn. Soar. That's 10 and then another 20 to go here. That's perfect. And I say, <laughs> you better have an apple. 
That's it. That's all. You, that's just what I want. I just want uh, for ten. Oh, budget. come on! So close. So close. Um, because you better like these apples. I don't know. I got nothing right now, guys. I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, yeah. And oh, that guy is gonna repost day right back at you. Oh. No, Wait, no, really? Because I'm I hit. Huh? I hit. I hit. I know, but it's just his turn. He's gonna. Yeah, go. I know. Yeah, yeah. No, it's just. His turn. Uh, what's your AC? Sixteen. Yep. Okay, so he's gonna hit you for three minus three slashing. What is that? I, I get an image of like his sword like going into my armor and then like scrunching up. Bring. So <laughs> it pretty much just hits your armor and slides right off, and he's just like <laughs> staring at a sword. Like sword I thought I gotta clean more. it. Uh, this next guy is going to, oh, he's going to shoot again at, uh, Theo, and he's going to miss. Uh, then these next two guys are going to make some wisdom saves. He's going to pass. He's going to fail. So one of them will attack. And miss. Nice. Very Theo. Nice. All right. Uh, I will shoot again at the one in the trees. Okay. Take him down. And yeah. Uh, you. It's good to be back. Good stuff. Uh, anything else? Um... Yeah, actually, now I've got some some room to move here. Um, I'm gonna jump off of the cart uh, and move into the brush, right? Okay. Like move into the woods area, and okay. then I, now I'm gonna try and hide. So. Okay. So. Okay. I rolled a, an eighteen. Father Manny. All right. I'm going to cast Toll the Dead on the guy by Soar. Okay. Nice. Oh. <laughs> For one necrotic. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> What's your DC? Um, like 13, I think. Hold up. Let me just check. What's your wisdom modifier? Oh, me? it's five. No, his wisdom modifier is three. So plus oh, two. Yeah. Plus eight, 13. Yeah. Uh, he's going to pass. Yeah. All right. And then. Um, I'm in the, I'm in the cart, right? The, the ghost Correct. cart. Okay. I'll lay, I'll lay down. Okay. And that'll be my turn. Dragonborn. All right. I am just going to... Um, I am going to stand my ground and prepare a dodge action. Okay. While uh, saying to them... This battle is clearly lost. You should move on with your miserable lives. Persuasion. There you go. Hey. Soar. So, okay. The one in front of me, is he trying to run away from the persuasion of that one? Um, I don't know. You're reacting faster than he is. Fair enough. I'm going to do a non-lethal blow. My intention okay. is to essentially have my foot on his chest on the ground. Okay. With like, just like, don't you dare move. I own you, sir. That's the idea of this. Oh, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. As I just, I essentially point my Warhammer at his head, foot on him, like completely just, you are trapped by me. As I patiently wait for our new friend to dispose of the other two. Look, see no bloodshed. 
That's what, that's what he does. You literally just hit him on the head and are now standing on him. No blood, bludgeoning, no cuts. <laughs> I imagine the guy is like, just leave. <laughs> 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 Uh, Source sees that and like put, goes down with his cape and like wipes it off <laughs> and then stands back up again. <laughs> That's awesome. So, interestingly, I'm on top of him now. Okay, move your. No. Like... <laughs> uh, so, he is not dead. I need an uh, unconscious thing. We'll do this one. Okay. Cool. <laughs> I don't care. There you, go, buddy. you don't need to click on him anymore. Uh, um, <laughs> these guys, you've rolled a what for persuasion? 17. 17. I have not rolled my persuasions well. Uh, okay. Um, one of them will stop. This guy will stop. And this guy will roll a wisdom save. <laughs> and fail and not attack either. Do I know that he he was still wanting to attack me, though? Um, is, is, is that apparent? Yeah, so you see him, like, pick up his sword to go to attack you, and then as the person who casts Sanctuary, you can tell that his reaction is because of the spell and not because of your speech. Makes sense. Theo, you were up. Um, so if I want to, like, shout something and try and get them to stop fighting as well, uh... Is that my action, or is that a bonus action? Uh, I mean, it really depends on what else you're doing. I was just thinking about, like... Ah, what the heck, I'll just shoot him. Okay. <laughs> I'll just shoot the one who... Oops. Just who cares, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah just shoot him. Yeah. And which one are you shooting? Oh, the one on the other side of... Uh, so the, uh, the one on the... Oh. This guy? Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. He's absolutely obliterated. <laughs> <laughs> Would he be yeah. obliterated without the sneak attack? Yes, because you've hit him with the Morningstar. Yes, yes. He, he, he was dead without the sneak attack, but with the sneak attack, he's obliterated. Okay. Pins him to a tree on the other side. <laughs> Anything else, Theo? Uh, hide again, <laughs> just in okay. case. Go ahead. Uh... Same thing. Father Manny. All right. I'm going to peek over the edge of the cart and just cast one more till the dead. <laughs> yeah, you got this. <laughs> well, he has not been hit, so it's a D8, so you're going to have to re-roll. Oh, but... okay. He fails. Oh, I guess it didn't really matter anyway. You take one point in necrotic damage. <laughs> one point. All right, I'll lie back down in shame. <laughs> in a ball? <laughs> yes. Curled in. Dragonborn. So, I, I look behind me as that guy just takes an arrow in, in the eye sock, and I'm like, <laughs> well... The battle has come to an end. Let us all lay down our weapons. And I just kind of put my arm around the guy in front of me. I assume I'm much taller than him. I'm like six foot much seven. Taller, yes. So, <laughs> and I, I, I just put my arm around him and I say, what is your name, friend? Jose. That's not you. <laughs> okay. Uh, Soar, you are standing on this guy, correct? Not doing anything else? Oh, no, hold on. I'm shouting things. Okay. <laughs> Are you sure the battle's over? That one's not done. Do something with him. Can I respond? Sure. 
He has decided that he is done fighting, and that and thus the battle is complete. No, 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 no. <laughs> Theo. Um, well, it's his turn. So what's he say? <laughs> it is his turn. Uh, as this giant dragonborn puts his arm around him and basically says, "The battle is done." Um, he will drop his sword and his crossbow. And does he tell me his name? Oh, you did ask him his name. I did. Uh, oh, oh, oh okay, hold on. <laughs> Mike's like, uh, name, name, I, uh. Jose. No, no, I, I, gotta, I gotta fit it with the theme. I didn't think we'd get to talk. Is it Gary? No one is, he, he just assumed we'd slaughter everyone. Who, who, whoever asked well, him. I mean, I, 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 non-lethal blow here. My character is proud of you for restraint. I did not have restraint. Um, his name. I need someone. Okay. Um, ooh, I like this name. His name is. He tells you his name is Smitty. Smitty. <laughs> Smitty. <laughs> could you could you des describe Smitty for me? Paint me a mental picture. Um, I don't have a picture of Smitty, but I could tell you that. Ooh, he's actually pretty tall, so you're not that much taller than him. Ooh, Smitty, big boy. How tall are you? Six seven. Yeah, he is six five. Dang. He's Look, six I... five two fifteen. Woo. Um, he is uh he's he's very young uh he appears to when he was hitting you he was hitting you with his right hand um <laughs> I, I, what i would love is as he describes these things theo shoots him in the heart <laughs> 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 got a cold, cold yeah, it's like, it's like, 19, 19 years old you see you see a you know, wedding ring on his hand because like, i imagine it is theo's turn now <laughs> it is my turn that's true. it is technically his <laughs> turn yes you do what you want theo i am actually gonna for now stay hidden i don't know this guy from adam i ain't gonna trust him yet that's true you, you have no idea who i am so i say nothing i'm just gonna hold my turn Okay, Father Manny. Um, <laughs> what would Father Manny do? Um, I say we show no mercy. Let's let's leave no witnesses. <laughs> Does that include the the scaly one? Yeah, um, no, I haven't quite made up my mind on him yet. I do admire his power, his his capabilities with persuasion. Although I will say having two large men who yell incoherently around could get quite ag aggravating. <laughs> but I will cast... What? Theo is not so large. I, <laughs> you will I don't cast... need to be. I'm so good I don't need to be. I will cast Told the Dead on Smitty. <laughs> <laughs> and he has taken damage now, so it's a D12. He has taken damage now, so it is the D12. <laughs> oh, oh, come on, Smitty. Oh, <laughs> oh no, I did <laughs> He fails. Oh, no! It's not a one. He's still alive. <laughs> oh, no, Smitty! <laughs> As Father Manny points to Smitty and uh, the dragonborn is talking to him. You just see almost all the life just leave his eyes as he starts wobbling about to fall to his oh, knees. No. <laughs> oh, no. That's not what I want at all. Well, in that case, I'll go ahead and I'm going to use my action. So do I, do I, do I recognize where that spell came from? Uh, I believe that, yeah, so Father Manny had to stand up and point to him so you could see him point to him. And it is, uh, 
Yeah, of course he doesn't have it. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Weirdest fight. I love this. Oh man. Well, nonetheless, what I'll do uh, first... I believe he has to say something as well when he does it, so... I think that's right. I think there is a vocal component to it. For me? Uh, the, yeah, for the spell. I think the spell does have a vocal component to it. Oh. So... Die! <laughs> no, I don't need you to actually say something. <laughs> <laughs> just whisper it then. <laughs> no witnesses. <laughs> <laughs> Out of character, Austin really likes that John just said the word die when we told him <laughs> there had to be a vocal component. <laughs> so yeah, I just picture Father Pandy standing up, point at the guy going, die, and lying back down. <laughs> like he's the emperor <laughs> or something, you know? It's amazing. Well, I'm going to use my action to use lay on hands on Smitty. Okay. <laughs> What is that? I'm going. I'm going to give Smitty back um, nine hit points. Okay. I'm going no! to steal Smitty nine hit points. <laughs> it's been a very <laughs> confusing roller coaster for Smitty here. <laughs> Smitty is having the weirdest friggin' day. All of his Smitty friends has... are dead. Am I just no going to take turns like killing him, and Austin's going to heal him <laughs> back and forth? <laughs> Sore. Are wait, you, wait, wait. I want to say something as well. Yeah, yeah go ahead. <laughs> <And I'm> like, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. So, and then my character will then just shout through the cart because he can't see the man in it. Stop! Stop! In the name of Pinstripe City, my name is Sir Almond Rise of the Magistrate. And as, I, com as I command you to stop. The authority of ballism supersedes all. So as as Almond Rise, which is an incredible name, uh, says that um, a javelin comes thrown thrown through the woods. <laughs> God <Smitty>. damn it! <laughs> Who are you throwing it at? <laughs> throwing it at Smitty. Uh, well, you're gonna miss. I know. Is he prone or something now, though? No, like, I got my nope, arm around he's not him. Not prone. <laughs> <laughs> It was my bad arm. <laughs> if anything, he's got like half cover because I'm like, ah. Oh. Uh, that's what I miss. <laughs> this is my baby. Like, oh. Can we end this already? It is already over, sir. Not with him alive. Okay, I need what everyone to roll <laughs> a perception. Actually, what's everyone's passive perceptions? Um, Ten. I have like a 12. 10. 11. Oh no, passive persuasion, 12. Passive percept perception. No, oh, perception, sorry. Uh, uh, 13. 10. 10. 13 is the highest, okay. Just let him go. Uh, so, after all Ryan. this confusion, you guys do happen to see another guy. 17 more men just come out of the woods. And just start. Let's see. He he can. He's gonna use his action to dash. So he is gonna go. Oh, rough terrain. <laughs> Bye. All the way to there. And he is just booking it. <laughs> <laughs> just running as fast as he can. Meanwhile, Smitty. Oh, I forgot to roll for the other guy. To see how long he's knocked unconscious. Four hours. Wow. Good good work, Sore. Uh, Smitty is just going to look up at uh, Sir Almond Rise and, like, just <laughs> look at him and be like, ah, What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> You're okay. Your guess is as good as mine. I'm, tr I'm working, tr trying to work here. This is, this is, I do not know these guys, and I don't think I like them very much. Theo, you're up. I, like, I guess I'm gonna just keep. I'm not gonna shoot anything or hurt anyone yet. Nothing's going on. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna 
hold my action until someone attacks one of my people. <laughs> Father Manny. <laughs> Don't you dare. <laughs> Don't you do it. <laughs> <laughs> um... Die! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, we're one? We're one? <laughs> All right. He fails and he's gonna lose one. <laughs> oh no! That's good. he's okay though. He's good. That's sick. Die. He's fine. <laughs> he's like Reaper What's and he? the Star Wars Emperor Emperor Palpatine in one. <laughs> <laughs> Sir oh Alman Rice. Gosh. I am going to just take Smitty and just like push him behind me as I now move oh one, God. two, three, four. Eight. I'm going to jump in the cart. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, out of my way, you're blocking my yeah, shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I... Did you lay back down again? Yeah, he's lying back down. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, how, how does Father Manny look? Does he look, does he look weak? Does he look injured? Yeah, Don't. About 50-50. Don't he, even think old, of it. He's an old man laying down in a way. Yeah. Like, yeah. I'm gonna... I I'm see going... you eyeing me. I'm going to grapple him. Okay. Uh, whoa. Un unhand I'm going... me. I'm going to grapple him. So that's my athletics versus his either, either athletics, ac athletics or, or acrobatics. Okay. Okay. Wow, I am just rolling garbage, but uh. good thing he's worse. <laughs> good thing he's a 65-year-old man. Yes, does it make you feel good to pick on an old man? <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I have asked and I have commanded you. You you are not to harm that individual. He is under my protection. Saw, javelin, now. <laughs> <laughs> um... So I have a, okay. Sor is going to run all the way up here. I uh, pretty much be like, <clears throat> unhand him. You, you, he is not under your protection. You swung a, a morning star at one and then killed him. Look at him. You did that. You a hypocrite. You know, protector. <laughs> You, you strike fear and and command, and, and we were just doing just fine before you showed up. Put him down, <laughs> sir. I was merely protecting myself, and after there was after that was completed, I wish for there to be no more bloodshed on either side. You were you were never attacked. What you showed up and just <laughs> demanded things. Yes, who are you? <laughs> Gone. So, oh no, one's getting away. Yeah, well, Kill him. Smitty get away. Uh, at, so that wasn't Smitty that got away. It was oh, I know, one. I know, but now Smitty. <laughs> and now Smitty's going to start running away. Yeah. <laughs> As he should. I, I had a feeling, yeah. <laughs> Um, if you guys are letting Smitty go, we could get out of combat. Yes, please. <laughs> okay, Smitty's gone. Smitty, wait! <laughs> oh my lord. I'd like to shout from hiding. I'd put him down unless you want an arrow in the back of your head. Yes, that's my boy right there. I have my hammer pretty much right at, right at this. I'm like eye level with all the rise. I'm up in the cart. I'm in there. Oh, right. I get in there. <laughs> yeah, I can't actually get in the. It's only one box, but it's supposed to be two. We've taken up the cart. It's supposed to be oh, two. Yeah. I'm in the cart with you. It's supposed to be bigger. But I. Well, I'll say this: If Lord Doubleday allowed Smitty to get away, clearly he smiles down upon him. So we'll allow it. But you must explain yourself, sir. Who are you? In. I am going to. As a bonus action, 
do my channel divinity. Emissary of peace. Oh, so man, I now have plus five to all my persuasion checks. Man, why can't Baylor get this? Five. So I'm just going to still holding Father Manny because I am actually, no, Smitty ran away. It's fine. I'm, I'm letting him go. Ooh, the cart has expanded. <laughs> <laughs> this is a magical cart. I love this cart. It warps. This cart is cooler than glass ever was. Um, so I, I will I will release the old man, and I will once again introduce myself. My name is Sir Almond Rise of the Magistrate from Pinstripe City. I am on a journey down to National City. I was told that I would need to meet with the mayor. He had some request to find his courier. And I wanted to get details on that mission so that I would be able to help in amassing the East as a cohesive unit to find out who ought to be our next king. Well, funny you should mention that. We're actually on the exact same journey. Then why was it that you were killing all of these men? Look, looks around. There are bodies laden in the street. You just they hear a voice shot us? from in the trees. They attacked us first. <laughs> <laughs> well, did you try to communicate with them? Maybe they simply wanted to do some kind of transaction. You tried with your pinstripe shields. And that didn't work. You can't mess with these. And look, look. I know your type. I know how you think that you are just better than all of us. Everyone wants to be a part of you and you are so many kings and, and victories in your day. Well, 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 we will not hear of it here. We are just as good as you are. And now that you guys are getting a closer look at this guy, he, again, big guy, like six foot seven. He's a white dragonborn, so he's got white scales bright blue eyes. Uh, but what's weird about this, usually when you see Dragon Board, they're all one color. This guy has uh, just a couple columns of thin black scales that go down his cheek, down his neck, of just these thin black columns, almost almost as if they were pinstripes. Um, as, as if that was uh, what, what that was. And so... Now, I, I'm very curious. Uh, I see you look as you do when I'm when you're in your city, but but it's strange to see someone on the road looking as you do. Well, clearly, these roads are dangerous. Whether it be from these men who meant you harm, it would seem, or whether it would be you who meant them harm. I do not know. I we simply do. came upon the situation and wished it to end. Well... Well, no, no, I expected you to be gray and not white with this pinstripes, as you are on the road. And I, 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 we, they attacked us. We saw this tree. I, I'm strong. I tried to remove tree. They shoot at me. They yes. clearly only speak the way of violence. I know violence. I there showed them my Warhammer of Darthen. Then you arrive. And you show them violence, too. I thought we were on the same page. Clearly not. Never touch Father Manny again. Yes, that's right. There's no end to conflict more final than death. That's a saying that we live by. <laughs> what? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Pinstripe City isn't isn't one of your biggest exports supremely large apples. We have been known for our orchards, yes. Do you, do you have any on you? My my friend Saw here is uh, yes. quite a fan. Please. You might be able to win him over. I I, I would have uh, if I had not recently lost the vast majority of my belongings, my uh, my squire uh, seems to have decided that he would be better off 
without me. And so I, after, uh, after staying at a nearby inn, I, uh, I awoke this morning to find that my horse and my squire and all of my belongings, save for my armor and my weapons and a bit of gold that I was able to have on me at the moment, all of that was gone. He seemed to have taken it all who knows where. Who is this squire? Uh, his, uh, his name, I, his name is one that I had already, already forgotten. I, I, I've <laughs> put it out of my mind. He is, he's but not to me at this point. <laughs> Wasn't it, uh, I, I heard once of a squire from Pinstripe City named Dom Jace, but I don't know if, uh, if, or maybe some people call him Jace Dom, but I believe it was Dom Jace. Uh, Hood, Hood, in future would be a great knight, but but the only squire that I know. Well, I I can't say I'm familiar with a Dom Jace, but I uh, I, I know many knights of Pinstripe City, and I I hope that. You are not an enemy of the East or of Pinstripe City. Certainly not of the East. <clears throat> you must know the clan of Lagany. Yes, I'm quite familiar. Uh, just uh, our neighbor and and uh, a bit, equal. Bit of, yes, bit of a bit of a rivalry there, of course. We, we 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 are we are equals, and we understand and respect each other. Sure. Sure, yes, we'll, we'll, good, yes. Good, good. <clears throat> Understood, yes. Is it Lagany, a small, rundown village on the outskirts of Pinstripe City? <laughs> no? <laughs> no, no, you have us confused with uh, the, the, the Stat Isles. Ah, yes. 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 I am not picking up on any of these <laughs> puns you're putting down. Not a single freaking one. Yeah. I do not that get I understand it. All of them. Uh, <laughs> I am not getting any of them. <laughs> just, just, just so you all are aware, uh, Pinstripe City is different than Apple City. Yes. So the yes. tribe of Lagany is in it's the near territory Apple of Apple City, not yes. Pinstripe City. I'd, I assume I'm still familiar with it, though. Yes, you would still yeah. be familiar with it. Yes, I'm just just so you all players know. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. Amazing. So at this point, is done with this conversation, and is going to do two things: one, inspect all the dead bodies, and two, drag his wonderful unconscious friend into the car. Okay. Would anyone help, like to see what our friends brought for us? Yes, let's inspect the corpses. I'll give I'll give Father Manny a hand. We're one short, but there's enough here. Well, actually, I'm going to go over to uh, the, how do you say your name again, Austin? Uh, Sir Alman Rye. Oh my Lord, John! What are we doing? Oh, <laughs> oh are we so bad? Sir um, you correct me that you don't have any belongings or anything? I I have very little. I was only able to keep what I had not bestowed upon my squire, which is mainly the armor upon my back, the shield on my arm, and my trusty morning star. But otherwise, it's very, very little at this point. So... All right, well... I reach into my purse. I count out about sixteen hundred gold. <laughs> I hand it back to to, uh, to, uh, to good old to a random stranger, <laughs> and uh, be like, "Well, tell you what, we had a buddy who uh, who uh, lost this, and I think he'd wanted to go to you." Um, does Sore notice this? <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Does Sor realize this is happening? <laughs> Mike? Um, Just trying to be a good guy. What's your passive perception? 11. Uh, oh my gosh. What's your passive 
probably not because he has a passive okay. stealth of okay. higher. No idea it's going on. Oh gosh. Fine. I don't support this revenue sharing, but my, my, so I really right, insist right, upon right. it, Theo. It's revenue sharing. My good son. a hunch. I, 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 I think this is what Glass would have wanted. I, I yes. thank you. I, I'm for for the first time in many many a moon. I'm I'm left I'm left speechless. What what is your name, sir? What what do they call name, you? The name is Theo Theo Gratias. Spread the word. I'm a pretty great guy. <laughs> Theo, where just great right in battle? Theo, right from whence do you hail? Where where do you, where do you call home? So originally, uh, hang on, let me pull up my sheet. This one. Backstory. Yeah, right. Um, okay, so originally, I grew up around. Um, where's the White Sox city? Uh, is it? Oh, Chiso. I originally grew up in Chiso, but then spent most of my adult life building a reputation for being the greatest all around over in Bright Bay. Fantastic. I've I've not had the opportunity to visit Bright Bay, but I I hear. Many great things. I hear that your infrastructures are impressively large. While this is true, uh, I would not spend much, too much time in their, you know, their facilities for contesting. But other than that, it's a pretty great time uh, all around. Well, I, I thank you for your kindness. Uh, you, I, I, did I hear you correctly in saying that you gentlemen have recently met with? The mayor of National City? Indeed. Yes. Yes, we have. So it seems we're on a similar mission. Our goals you, are one and the same. You as well are, are seeking out this this courier, this man who is who is meant to meet with the leaders of Pinstripe City, and you 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 seek him out as well, then. Yes. And we're actually a man down. We had a uh, former partner in our crew. Quite useless cleric. Uh, really, never, truly. Never healed anyone. Never cared about anyone but himself. Uh, he ultimately got what was coming to him. Um, but we do have room now in our in our crew, and I, I believe we can offer you some protection. Um, yeah. There is one stipulation. You split a third of everything you get with each of us. If so, assuming I I split a third with each of you, does that leave? I, yes, you get nothing. I get nothing. Yes, that's right. I, in, okay. Uh, that's that's the arrangement <laughs> I'm proposing. I <laughs> I would that's offer a deal we've ever had before. I would offer a counter. Quiet. Uh, a count, counter proposal. Uh, let's say for every for every man that uh every man that you strike down i give you two gold hmm you drive a hard bargain make it five gold and we have a deal hmm it, is this not is that i need you, any more you, motivation to kill but Father five Manny, gold would, you, is five would gold. you say as a pro this is your rate Yes, this is. <laughs> this will be my pro-rated salary. You might, you might even say. <laughs> oh no! Uh, Nick, give yourself inspiration. Yes! <laughs> God bless it. Um, yes. Well, I. I would. I. I'm I'm a bit conflicted. Well, I, time is money, so uh, make up well, your mind. May, maybe we could. Where where are you bound? Are you I, you've you've left National City recently, and you're you're bound north. Yes, Magic City. Magic City. I I I passed through. I haven't had a chance to really take in the sights or meet with anyone of import, but I. If I need not go down to National City, maybe I could at least travel with you, gents, for uh, for a time. 
and hopefully we can find this courier along our way and we can figure out what it was that what it was that uh, befell him and possibly complete his mission. I I will say that I am generally against uh, the killing of most that uh, that uh, can be saved, can be redeemed. And so it let us come back to this this offer you have. I, I I would I would like to continue negotiations. I mean, there's only so much room on the cart. I can only make room if I'm properly motivated. <laughs> Gentlemen, we can do this in good faith. No. Then he can. No. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, I let's let's say it, as as your friend here and your, your name, sir. I, I don't believe I caught your name. Ah, uh, yes, my name's Father Manny. Father Manny, I'm a uh, high priest of Ballism. I'm sure you've heard of it. And, Mike, how prevalent is Ballism? Would I have heard of it? Uh you would have heard of it in passing. I don't know if any of the respected people that you deal with have are followers of ballism. So you've heard of it. it, it it's it's kind of culty to you. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Um, well, I I am I can't say I'm too familiar with your faith, but as a man of faith, I give you my word that I shall cause I shall cause you and your two compatriots, no harm, and I shall work to defend you. Yes, but and... the, the money. What uh, about the money? Uh, uh, yes, I... <clears throat> <laughs> well, uh, let's... Let's say I give you, right now, as, as, a, as a sign of good faith in these negotiations going forward, I give you 50 gold. All right, fair enough. In the interest of time, I will accept your 50 gold. And we will continue and, these and, uh, negotiations further down well, the road. Right? Yes. Of course, 50 gold for listening to this blathering for so long. We will have a collective bargaining agreement at some point, <laughs> you could say. <laughs> and we'll we'll work it out. Uh, how do you guys do this? <laughs> I'm just not that witty. <laughs> oh, man. So I'll take your 50 gold. Thank yeah, you. I will. And, and mine as well. Oh, I, I, to, to each yes. of you. Is yes, that... yes, that's the deal. Yes, yes. I, yes. Okay. Um, yes. Seems... No, that, that, that seems fair. And yes. I will get 50 gold to yes, soar. Of course. Yes, yes. Yep. And uh, from yes. the money that, from the money <laughs> yes. that Theo just gave me, I'll get it back to him. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes, sir. So, Theo, how much had you given to me? 1600. Okay, that was what I got off of you. That's what I got off a of glass. Gold. Wait, I thought you split that with Father Manny. No, that was all my. No, I tried I to off. get some, but he wouldn't give yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> and then you defended him. <laughs> oh, amazing. So, Unreal. So I, I, I basically receive fourteen fifty as I dole out my. Okay. My well, penance to each of you. Well then, all right. You don't have apples. No. You, no. You, you, you speak of uh, of saving everyone. Well, are you going to save him? I point to the the man on the ground, and I and I as Thor goes down, he looks at his shirt and pulls back the the name on the tag, like reads his name tag, like as if he's at camp or something like that. It belongs to. Uh, uh, you you're talking about the. Uh... The yeah, the, the bandit guy. that I... The bandit? Yes. Yeah. His name is tag. Lugo. Lugo? Yes. Lugo! I, I knew a, I knew a Lugo very well. This, and he looks at his face and goes, Not this one! Not this one! <laughs> Not this one. <laughs> is he, he, is, he saved this... me out of very many, many situations. Nice. Nice. But, <laughs> so we've, we've got uh, Lugo now in the cart. Yes. My foot is still on his chest in case he wakes up. Well, I will 
uh, lay my hand on him and I will give him a single hit point of health oh, back. Okay. With a can I can hands. I make sure I'm grappled with him when keeping him down? Uh, I mean, you could keep your foot on him. You are a lot stronger than he is, yeah, so I don't okay. even need you to roll. Uh -huh. okay. So I will uh, heal him a slight bit just to bring him back to consciousness. Oh, look at that! Father Manny, someone who heals well. Yes, finally. <laughs> it's about time somebody chose it to do that. It is about time. Leaving some... So some Space for us fighters, you know, to lay down the law. Amazing. <laughs> so Lugo will wake up, okay. see this giant man stand on top of him uh, in a cart that he is thought his guys would help take care of, surrounded by all the people he bombarded, realizing that he has utterly failed. Source shouts. Why did you attack? You you entered our territory. This is your territory? Yes, yes, yes. This Where is, is the, the territory sign? of the renegades? Ah, uh, I see. Do you have a, a hideout? No. No hideout for, for you. The renegades don't don't live somewhere. No. Uh, uh, Sor, was it? Is that that is your name. Sor Thunderguard. Yes, Fantastic. obviously. Uh, Sir Roman Rise. Uh, may I speak with him a moment? Roman eyes. Yes. Roll my eyes all the time. Okay. Uh, just, if you if you would if you wouldn't mind just keeping your boot, uh, which is far nicer than I expected it to be. If you would continue keeping your boot firmly placed upon his chest, I think that would... What have I devolved into? No one's quite sure, Nick. We're, <laughs> uh, we're, we're going to send a uh, wellness check to you, so oh my uh, God. expect to see John over uh, in, just, in a few hours. There we go. Um, yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> if you would just keep your boot placed firmly upon his chest, I think that would maintain safety for everyone involved. And uh, I, I know that. And... Uh, you, sir, your, your name is Lugo, yes? Yeah. Fantastic. Again, my name is Sir Ullman Rise of the Magistrate. I, I mean you no harm, and I, uh, I, I wish you nothing but peace. Now, your men, they, they seem to have attacked this cart and these men here. Is that, is that correct? Uh, yeah. Yeah, they entered our territory. And I... Uh, are you so territorial that a passing cart is not that is it is a threat to you? You wish you wish to keep everyone out. How how do you how do you sustain? How do you eat? Well, I we figure that uh, anyone who travels this road is has allegiance to the people running Devil City, and we do not support them. I understand. So it is not a feud specifically with these men, but with the with with the uh, with the leaders of Devil City. Now, gentlemen, do you uh, have you ever been to Devil City, or have you met with the leaders of Devil City any time in your life? Talk no, you. I st I stay no. away. It's full of heretics. We, uh, we once sent someone, um, mm, Ka Kazmir, maybe? Kaz? Some, uh, to Devil City, but well, I've never been. Right, so, Lugo, it would, it it would appear, now, Lugo, it would appear that your men have mistakenly assumed that these three were in league with Devil City, which they clearly are not. They have never been there, nor have they spoken with their leaders in their lives. So, we mean you no further harm. Uh, it is a great sorrow to me personally that your friends and compatriots had to, had to fall in this battle. And I wish you to forgive and forget now. Can we help you get back to your friends and clear up any further misunderstanding with these men here? 
Uh, he will look at you for a bit. Roll Please persuasion. Let me roll persuasion. Plus, oh. so I'm going to add... Um, I'm going to add 11 to whatever I roll. Oh, my lord. Uh, so it's going to be this plus 5. So 24. Okay. Uh, he is going to look at you and be like, well, well, I could show you where we live and you could take me back there. Yes, that that's that's what you want to do. Take me home. Yes, yes if, if you could lead us to Smitty, we have some um, unfinished business to, to, to attend to. Yes, did, that'd be nice. Father, did, father, please. Did Smitty get away? Yes, Smitty lives. He is well. There seemed to be one other member of your band that also was lucky enough to escape. But it would appear that... And, and, and at this point, Glass, or not Glass, but uh, Almond will stand up and go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 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 nine or ten. The, there are many bodies strewn about, and I, again. And we can I'll, add yours to it, too. So <laughs> I, I, I would just. A, we, but we can! <laughs> that is something that could happen, but doesn't That's need good. to. That's, well, it's completely it unnecessary. Very good news that Smitty and this other mysterious friend have escaped, and it'll be great <laughs> if you could take me home. Fantastic. Now, uh, if we could uh, go on our way, then I'm sure that uh, we. I'm sure that you'd like to find the rest of your band and collect your fallen compatriots here again. My deepest sympathies. Wait, but why? Why did they? Hmm. Hmm. Well, you see, so it was all a yes. misunderstanding. They they thought that you had been working with the leaders of Devil City, which clearly isn't the case. You you mentioned seems like a, you assume too much. That's bad. <sighs> Look what so, happened. You assumed. So, bad. so Lugo, may I suggest that in the future, instead of simply attacking. You uh, maybe you should clarify who someone is prior to shooting them with crossbows. You're right. I must change our ways. Yes, yes. Fantastic. Well, now if he could just take me home, that would be great. Of course. Let's. Where's let's home? Lead the oh, way. I, I'll show you. Well, should we so poorly. should we set up camp first? <laughs> All of this uh, caring about other people has exhausted me. Oh, I, I assure you, you, you can get plenty of rest in our camp. Fantastic. Okay. Well, how far away is this camp? Oh, not too far. Only a few hours. Well, then, well we can uh, rest in the meantime. Can we, can we take our cart or must we go on foot? Uh, I would prefer if you took the cart. It would be much easier. Oh, fantastic. Then, um, uh, can we tell if he like is leading us on or like? Essentially, like holding something back. Yeah, it's roll an insight check. Me. Roll what? Yeah, yeah. Insight. I'll roll with you. Mm -hmm. Almond is one hundred percent convinced this guy is telling the truth. Hey, look at, us. look at us! How did we get here? Huh? Nice and done. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh, you get this strange feeling that he's being very agreeable way too soon. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> um, so your Sor's foot is still on him, right? Yeah, I was about to say, Sor is going to press harder into into uh, Lugo here. He still only got one hit point, right? Yeah, that's okay. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. One like, slowly, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can't kick him or anything then. No, 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 I say, <clears throat> sure, you're not working us into a trap, are you? As I push down harder. That would be unwise, Lugo. No, no, of course not. No. Why take chances? To make... Mm, because because my old teacher taught me to. To also make mistakes. She had a wonderful bus. Yeah, I'll pull up my reaper and stick it and be like, because I know when someone's trying to con someone. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, you sound awful all of a sudden. Your mic is, is weird. Yeah, I know. I don't know what's going on. 
<laughs> Sounds like you've got some kind of robot filter. <laughs> That's not what I'm hearing. I'm hearing something completely different. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Um, well, okay. This might be a good time to uh, just stop for this week. I agree. <laughs> As we have the questionable Lugo, the new member of Almond Rise, Sir Almond Rise. Roll my eyes is the better name, but you know, Roll that's my fine. eyes. That's fine. What are your eyes? But I, uh, but I would like to thank everybody for tuning in for this week's episode. I uh, keep in mind moving forward, we are moving away from the live stream at four o'clock. Uh, we will be recording separately. It's going to be a little more sporadic because baseball has returned. Finally, yeah. at least to our understanding, if there is no baseball, well, you understand what we will be doing weekly. <laughs> once again but we will be getting these of course up on youtube uh, announcing on twitter at pitches.com slash twitter when they are obviously you can subscribe to our youtube channel to get alerted every single time they're up there as well at youtube.com slash pitchless but anyway thank you all for joining today on behalf of john metzelar daniel port michael levy and austin bristow i am nick pollock thank you all for joining us today